Maybell, where are we? We're at the Canyon. Oh, the Canyon store? Hey everybody, it's Brooke France and you're Mrs. Minnesota United States 2020 and today we are at the largest candy store. We came down to Southern Minnesota to be able to experience this amazing attraction, 27,000 square feet of candy. So my husband and I brought our kids and we are picking out some childhood favorites and my husband was also picking out a few things that I have to try that I can't say no to. So, come along with us. So as a kid, I loved everything sour. So warheads were my jam. I don't know now if I can handle them because I know your taste changes as you get older, but having all this different kinds of warhead candy, all of these things are like my childhood. So, I'm gonna try this one, the sourest of them one. all. <laughs> There's no reason anybody should ever need this much candy. <laughs> so we just spent all of our money, all of our cash that we had on candy. <laughs> Okay, so now that we are all done inside the candy store, wasn't that fun? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We are gonna be trying the most sour piece of candy that I found and also the items that Mac chose for me to try. Smile! <laughs> okay. Can you show them what it does? So we have it's sour. Nice. This is this is for mom. Can you give it to mom, please? Here you go. Try this. I like the pink one. Look at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> That's sour. <laughs> you, don't like you, don't like you don't like this one. So this is the sour forehead. Forehead. <laughs> Your mouth? Yeah. My mouth would it's already, always. It's already my watering. mouth would always water anytime. And it would always burn my tongue. It's a lot more sour as an adult. I spin it up. I spin it up. I'm like drooling. Hey. <laughs> so is that is what, that mine? Mm -hmm. Is that as sour as you remember? No, you don't. Know. It is as sour as I remember. But more sour as an adult now. Yeah. Woo. Okay, so we went through and I found a bunch of. I like that one different items. I have no idea. They look interesting. Some of them are just downright disgusting. Old Florida treats, pelican eggs. Pelican eggs. Do you want to try one? You ready? Okay, wait. One, two, oh, three. It's kind of good. Okay. It tastes like jelly bellies. Not what I expected. I expected a little bit more like Harry Potter's like nastiness. Yeah. Okay. Juvies. What is what I don't even know. What what do you think it is? Like juvies, I'm guessing are like the little like tapioca things that go at the bottom of bubble tea. Can I try one? What does it taste like? It's the texture of like pineapple actually. Interesting. Because like, it is coconut. Oh yeah, like and co pineapple. And coconut. Yeah. Is it like a booger? <laughs> she doesn't like it. I don't like it. Okay, so the last and final one that we're gonna do, we have a couple more, but we're out of time. Is that we're gonna do a jalapeno 
seasoned chocolate covered bacon. Here you go. Jalapeno. Jalapeno. Chocolate covered bacon. A meat treat. All right. Is it good? Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Is it spicy? Well, it has a little kick to it. Wait till the end. Okay. It's good. Mm -hmm. We do like this. Oh, okay. Here, Mabel. Here, Mabel. Yeah, I'm going to try some of that. And later, we're going to try mustard flavored soda, pickle flavored soda, and butter flavored soda. Yeah. So, what do you think? What do you think will be your favorite? None. None. So we are wrapping up here at the largest candy store in the world here in southern Minnesota. It was so much fun. It was so crazy. So cool. It's like a small little Disneyland. Mm -hmm. Do you have fun? Yeah. Do you get candy, Mabel? Do you get candy? No. <laughs> but now we are going to yes. Now we are going to have a nap from all the sugar highs. Yes. <laughs>